Hi guys, today we're going to study a new structure. Pay attention to this. Let's study comparative adjectives. We have some rules. First, for short adjectives, that means one syllable, like small, short, and fat, we're going to add ER at the end. So for small, smaller, short, shorter, and fat, fatter. Notice that when we have a short adjective formed by consonant, vowel consonant, like fat, we're going to double the last consonant. Look at the example in fat, fatter, we double the last consonant. Then when we have two syllable adjective ending in Y, like easy and dirty, so we change Y per I and we add ER. For example, easy, easier, dirty, dirtier. Also for long adjectives like difficult and beautiful that contains more than two syllables, we are not going to add ER at the end. We're going to add the word more. We say more difficult, more beautiful, more intelligent. And we have irregular adjectives like bad and good. So that means that we are not going to add ER at the end and the word more at the beginning. We have for bad, worse, good, better. Let's see some examples. My house is bigger than yours. The adjective big is formed by consonant, vowel consonant. So that means that we have to double the last consonant. That's why we have double G, bigger. Your grade is worse than mine. Remember, we are comparing two things, two objects, two animals, two countries. In this case, your grade and my grade. And worse is the comparative adjective for bad. The Pacific Ocean is deeper than the Arctic Ocean. You are more polite than joy. We use more because polite is a long adjective. My brother is taller than I am, but he is older too. A rose is more beautiful than a daisy. And the last example, the earth is larger than the moon. As you can see in all the sentences, we are comparing two things. It's important to use the verb to be, then the comparative adjective, the word then, and the second object. Now let's study superlative adjectives. For this, we are going to use the at the beginning and for short adjectives instead of er, est, the longest, the largest, the driest. In this case, we change y per i, remember, and then we add est. The biggest, we also double the last consonant. And for long adjectives, instead of adding the word more, we say most, the most beautiful, the most crowded, the most expensive. And for irregular adjectives, we have the best, the worst. We need to memorize the irregular adjectives. Now let's see some questions. Look. Which country is larger, Australia or Mexico? So the answer is, Australia is larger than Mexico. So we are comparing two countries. Which country is the largest in the world? So that means for a superlative adjective. Russia is the largest country. Which is more crowded, Malta or England? We're comparing. We answer, Malta is more crowded than England. And Malta is the most crowded country in Europe. Let's do some exercises. Let's complete questions from 1 to 4 with comparatives and questions from 5 to 8 with superlatives. The, the adjective that is between parentheses is the one that we are going to transform. For example, in number 1, which country is... Smaller, with ER, 
Monaco or the Vatican City. Then from five on, which is the highest, because it's for superlatives, which is the highest, Mount Concagua, Mount Everest or Mount Fuji. Now guys, take notes of the class and also write these exercises on your notebook. That's all for today. Thank you so much.